All right, ladies and gentlemen, the business end of the fight card. Fight number nine, fighting at a fusion fight and fitness, the amateur featherweight beast championship champion, Brody Maioki. Hey, first fight of our main card. This one is going to be exciting. Both undefeated fighters looking to give uh, to get rid of the zero for one of them. Yeah, definitely. Our first title fight of the night as well. This is a confident young man, Brody Maioki. Come. Comes from Fusion, where his, uh, his dad is the coach. He's got his brother Kyle in his corner as well. We've had a, a few fighters on this gym tonight. Obviously, we've been talking about the t taking the tally. Uh, this very, very confident young man. Very confident young both, man. They're both uh, very bright uh, futures ahead. Mm, amazing. Nice walkout song as well. Milkshake. I thought he might have been a, a little bit young to know this one, but... Amateur featherweights out there, you want to test yourself? Here it is. Very good jiu-jitsu as well. I know his opponent's a striker. I was actually talking to his opponent out the back. He thinks he's going to get it done in one, so... Hopefully the cowboy can deliver that, but uh, you know what? He has a big job ahead of him in the Brody Miochi tonight. Purple belt in jiu-jitsu, I believe. Here he is. That was supposed to be five rounds, but because for the white champion, Brody Maioki. So uh, Brody won't be coming for a haircut tonight. I think he'll be. Looking to get it down to the ground pretty early. And look for a submission. All right. And his opponent, fighting out of Beast Martial Arts, the challenger, Darcy the Cowboy House. Letting the, uh, the challenger, the local boy, walk out second. He's a character of this bloke, I'll tell you. He's very confident. He, he has come to scrap. The cowboy has come to scrap. <laughs> yeah, they, love the cow they love the cowboy here in Gladstone. wants to keep it standing. He's told me he's trained a lot of jiu-jitsu over the last three weeks. I mean, you know, I know three weeks is a short space of time to learn jiu-jitsu. I don't know uh, what he meant by, by that, but um, yeah, you know, he, he definitely doesn't want to go to the ground. I don't, I don't see this fight going anywhere else but to the ground. Me too. I, I, I definitely think that Brady's going to shoot early. Cowboy thinks he's going to shoot early. So, uh, you know, he might have something. He might have, he might have, he, he might have me on. He might have something else brewing for him. But uh, you can see here, Coach Miyoshi and, and Kyle giving son and the younger brother uh, his advice. He looks very confident. Have a look at him. This is, uh, this has to be the best book song of the night so far. Someone's always got to go. Who's it going to be? Look at this young man, Brody. I'm very impressed with how composed he is. Here he is. Everyone's favourite cowboy, Darcy the Cowboy he's House.
All right. This is a 65.8 kilogram amateur featherweight championship belt. Consisting of three by four minute rounds, proudly sponsored by Aztec. Fighting out of the blue corner, your amateur featherweight beast champion, Brody Mayoki. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, the challenger, Darcy the Cowboy House. All right, fighters to the center. Protect yourself at all times, listen to my instructions at all times. If you want to touch gloves, do it now. Come out swinging. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Make some noise right now. Look at that. I think, yeah, shoot. Look at that. Look at that. Straight away. They know it's going to happen, but they can't stop it. He knows it's going to happen. He knew he was going to shoot early, just couldn't stop it. It's just very really hard because they, they, they don't Darcy, overhook. They don't under, look, at, look at the resilience. Darcy. Yeah, he, that, he just really needs to relax now. Hot pressure. He really don't does. Hug Darcy. Get your underhook. Freddy knows what he's doing. He's, uh, he's yeah, there's some blood in. already. He's, he, he's happy there in, in, in half guard. Yeah, Darcy really needs to expose it. Uh, but you know, he's uh, yeah. He's going he's trying to set up an arm front or hit from half guard. Oh, it's actually is it no Brody's not bleeding, he's just got blood on him. Mm. I, I, it it looks like right Brody's trying to set up an arm trunk hit from half guard. Hard to do. Coming very popular. I saw Islam Makachev do it recently. Very hard to set up. No, right, what's he doing? He's trying to get him to mount. He can't oh, he's got side control here. He's going to get him to mount. He's, he's in mount. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's, it's one of those uh, situations. Yeah, where this is the start of the finish. Yeah, this is not going to end up well for the Cowboy here. If he needs to explode. He needs to get out of here because this is bad. This is bad for the Cowboy. He's going to get us. Oh, he's up. He's up. He's up. Oh, that was a bad shot. That was a bad shot there from Brody. That was a panic shot. I think Brody really needs to back himself here. He's... He needs to overhook. His, his, his head was in a terrible position in that shot. If he does that, it, uh, yeah. as I say that, he's back in the half guard. Get your leg mm. back, Darcy. It, it, it very clearly shows back. that he hasn't done any. Uh, Darcy hasn't done much uh, in regards to jujitsu. With yeah. the fact he's just Darcy trying to hold on. He's uh, he's not trying to create space to. Yeah, to get to, out get yeah you know, definitely. Yeah, Darcy can't stay here. He cannot stay here. He got mounted way too easy. If Brody needs to posture up here. Even if he Blood walks back to the cage, Darcy. tries to use the cage to stand up. Mm. But yeah, it, Brody really needs to get him away from the cage as well because the Cowboy's going to use it to get up soon. Darcy, mm. don't hug. Get your elbows yeah, in. Yeah, this is not... You can't, stand, you can't sit here like this Red and just defend with just Darcy. Just, we've only got three rounds. You know, our amateur fights are only three minutes. You, you just can't. You really got to get up. I don't think Brady's going to be gassing out anytime soon. So, mm, yeah, this is a this is bad. Darcy's is a big trouble. Don't forget to hit Darcy. He, he needs to look to bump. create space at the moment. All he's doing is just holding him. He's trying to hold like, him, I'll slow him down. He needs in. to get both hands on to the knee. Uh, now he's pinned one arm. Side. He's going for. You know what? I I, I thought that that. I thought that Brady was trying to set up a submission before. It looks like he's trying to finish him. I think he's trying to. He's trying to arm. He's definitely trying to get it. Yeah, look at that. He's got the. Look at that. Look how he's got that arm wrapped up. Look at how he's got that arm wrapped up. This is. Uh, yeah, this is great he's control. For six yeah, he's taking the stop. He's got. Oh no! Uh, two slippers. Yeah. Oh, oh wow. Darcy got a little nice underhook, but he's back on the ground. Yeah, this is bad. And it starts all over again. And now he's looking all for that over triangle. Triangle. He's, he's looking for that. I thought so. From ha it's from Mount now. It's from Mount. I think, I think the, cage is, the cage is really saving Darcy here. I, yeah, I think the, yeah, that, the cage being behind him is, is going to really help him. He needs to get him off the cage. Just the, the experience. He's so young and listen to him. He's breathing with every punch. 
You know, with old man's in there screaming for posture up. He's going for the armbar again. Oh, he's mounted triangle. Oh, oh no. He's I here. think he's going to save by the clock. It's going to save. Oh. Saved by the bell there. What a great dominant round for Brody. I, I don't know if you saw it. To be honest, I just don't think there's enough work uh, from the red corner in um, just. Uh, I think there was easy, easily the you know Brody's obviously won that round. If Cowboy's corner has spotted, or even Cowboy himself, that that shot from Brody was terrible. Came in head down. He wasn't even close. Hips out. Uh, I think you know if Del Ca Cowboy could definitely capitalize on that. Amazing, amazing round from our champ, Hot Brody Miochi. I'm, I'm, I'm getting uh, the, the boys mixed up here, man. Tom Cole's name too many times. I'd still like to see yeah, Brody think... back his striking a little no. bit more. Yeah, me too. Yeah, he, 100%. We know he's 100%. 100%. Uh, I, I want him to see him set these takedowns up instead of just, just shooting. Uh, yeah, really do. No, but uh, look at him. He's, 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 He's got a mouse under the eye. I think he, I think he got an upcut. He definitely copped the upcut on the yeah. way in. And um, you can see him rubbing his eye while he's yeah. on top. You know, looking at the body language, I think. Watching the early shots, yeah, Brody's fading. Don't overextend. Bro yeah, look. Don't he overextend those strikes, Yeah, okay. I think it's. Oh, oh wow. wow. That was much oh, better. Oh, look at that takedown. Mm, yeah, that was much better. I like to see that. He, he really set up a shot there. He needs to get him away from the cage. You've got to get him off the cage, Brody. Mm. Yeah. Got him to mount way too easy. Yeah, he knows. Yeah, he's got him off the cage now. Yeah, he's got his... Look at him. He's, he's, he's slid his left arm around to lock up Darcy's right hand. That's really frustrating. You know, he's, he's lucky he's got the cage there because it's really saving him. Mm. Yeah, it's the same. It's very similar to uh, what Khabib used to do. Yeah, yeah definitely. Go. They call it, what do they call it? The Dagestani uh, handcuff. handcuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah becoming very popular. And it's also a really good position from Saikatra. We reach around and grab the op your opponent's arm, ar armpit. And you can actually yeah. really look in that arm. Definitely. Thank you. Um, yeah, so he's got him away from the cage now. Uh, this is going to really be bad for Darcy. I really yeah. need to see Darcy attack Dar his knee. Oh, Darcy cannot stay here. He can't stay here. He's got to use everything he can to his play because he's going to get finished soon. He's going to step out for the arm. He is. He is. I think Brody can take his time a little bit more. I think he's rushing this. Oh, look at this. Oh, he's got the arm triangle. Ah, oh, he's in trouble. He's gone. That's done. Wow! Wow! That was impressive. That was impressive. Very nice finish from Brady. Very dominant. Amazing, Gabriel. amazing. Amateur featherweights. You want to test yourself? Here it is. Here it is. If you think Brody Miyoshi wants a break, you don't know Brody. He'll be looking for a quick turnaround. Amateur featherweights. That's how it's done. That is how it's done. Taking nothing away from Cowboy though. Took that on three weeks notice. He got out of it. A couple of those good positions. Even coming into the second round there, when they touch the gloves, stuff that first takedown. He's taking his first uh, loss tonight, but you know, that's what the amateurs are for, not to a bad bad fighter either. All he right, a, and the winner I think he's got by arm triangle in the second on. round, and still the featherweight amateur beast champion, Brody Mayoki. Amazing. Interesting choice of walkout song, Milkshake, the least. Oh, it's a great song, don't get me wrong. Um, 
Definitely I, think, not. I, think, I think those walkout songs go one or two ways, eh? Hyped yeah, up, 100%. 100%. 100%. What was your last walkout song? Um, I can't even remember, to be honest. I think it was like um, Ludacris or something. <laughs> something to get me in the mood. <laughs> I just like dancing my way Area into the AJ. Yeah, no, I like to have fun with my walkouts as well. All, all right, we're here I think the app with the beast, is amateur featherweight champion, still Brody Maoki. How's that sound, Bella? Um, pretty good, eh? Sounds sounds pretty good. I'll tell you what, from the sidelines, man, that was an awesome fight to watch. How did you find it? Um, I was shitting myself coming in. I knew he had knockout power, so I rushed the first couple of takedowns. But in the second, I was like, oh, I'll just try my stand up. So it worked out pretty good, and I got the takedown off nice, nice timing. So it worked out a lot better in the second round. And I was shitty. I didn't really want to like posture up and punch him. I don't know if like Dad was saying to do. I was like, nah. <laughs> he would have he would have rolled out too easy. It was too strong. So I'll tell you what, mate. That was an awesome fight to watch. So tell us, what's on the horizon for the champ? What's next? Um, two or three more fights next year. Probably more. At least two or three on Beast. And then um, after that, turn pro pretty pretty soon. Hopefully, get a couple more. I want to get a couple losses. Actually, I want to fight some really good dudes and just sort of a bit more experience and then I'll go pro. Well, I'll tell you what, mate, there's not many people that will stand here and say they want a couple of losses. So obviously that's a testament to your character and your sportsmanship. Here's our beast amateur champion, Brody Mayoki.